Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. We're coming to you live. We're doing a lot of lives lately. We're going to be doing more. Yeah, there's more coming. Why? This is the prelude to a kiss. Ooh, you can say. More like a prelude to a... Oh, I could go on. I was going to say French kiss. Ooh. Uh, you know what I didn't do is pull up Sounds the chat like box. That would be a good song. A prelude to a kiss. Uh, Bart and I are getting ready for this weekend's celebration. That's right. And I said, come over, let's have a dram. We may, if you are in town, I think we are going to the Monarch tonight. Have uh, lunch with some people that are in town. Dinner. and Or yeah, dinner. And maybe a drink or two. Have uh, lunch with some people that are in town. So come on down if you're in. Let me get the chat popped out here if anybody's in. There we go. Got a few people in. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Uh, we know, I know Roy is going live here in a little bit. We are not going to be live that long. We just wanted to come on and We're say, Bogart his feed, say hello to everybody. Say welcome to the weekend for the fifth anniversary. The Scotch, wristbands. Did you get a chance to watch the Scotch for dummies I yet video do yet? Okay. Yet to do it. Uh, Scotch for dummies did a uh, great video for the weekend today, uh, released it. A lot of people on there wishing us, giving us well wishes. Thank you, even though I haven't seen it. Thank you. Got a manga shirt on. You better believe there's going to be some manga being displayed this week. Weekend. How come you're talking like kids are sleeping or something? You're like, I've been a little, muttering. A little under the weather. Oh. Can you guys hear Bart? He's kind of mumbling. How mumbling good is your mic? How good is your mic? Can we bring that down? Right there there. Go. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> I bet you they hear me great. Well, you got that bottle already. Woo. You know, we need to do Duncan Harmsworth is tuning in. We need to print off his uh, toast that he came up with. Yes, we do. Time. There's a toast. Jeez, that's going to come up this week. By the way, I got that phone call. Has anybody, uh, there were supposed to be a couple more people signing up for Friday. No. Did you get anything uh -huh. on it? Okay. Nope, not yet. All right. I gave him the address, uh, the website. I said uh, uh, scotchtestdummies.com. Go to the events tab, and then you can go in there and get what you want. Uh, uh, yeah, so this, I miss a day. <laughs> the story of the Spaniard. No raster. Uh, story of the Spaniard derived. Uh, it was arranged to be sent to us. Uh, I'm not sure if he wants to be known, so we'll leave it anonymous right now, and uh, we'll check and see. So this is supposed to be added to the core range of Compass Box. I don't know if it was meant to replace Asyla, but Asyla was discontinued and the story of the Spaniard uh, introduced. Woo, yeah, the right. rainbow hat might make Bart feel better. That's true. I need a little unicorn on it. Just unicorns and rainbows, baby. But no, we just wanted to come on uh, early. Tell everybody we're right. getting ready for the weekend. Gregory says, uh, happy anniversary. Big cheers. Thank Thanks. you. There, there's Roy. Roy, we're not planning on being live that long. We we're just going, wanted to. We're bogarting uh, your feed, baby. We just wanted to say howdy. We're, we're bogarting it. Everybody. Uh, you guys going to do your top five budget available whiskeys. That'd be a good one. Top five budget available whiskeys. Roy wants to know, will we join him live for a toast to us both on his? I think um, we're pop in a little should bit. Should be able to. Yeah. yeah. Send us an invite. Yeah. Five years of whiskey bids, says Bird Dog. That's right. Thank you for the congrats. I think about between five and six o'clock tonight, we're going to head down to the Drury, uh, meet up with a couple of guys that are in town, probably go to the Monarch. And I'm not sure what the address is. It's uh, about 800 West Douglas. Uh, whiskey bar and restaurant there. There's a little roundabout right at the uh, Monarch. Because I can't remember what's the cross street right there, too. I should know. Mm, that's probably... It's fun to watch us try to name a street. Walnut? <laughs> no, Walnut's down. No, that's further sure. down. Yeah. yeah it's... Uh, Julius says, congrats, Scotch dudes. Thank you. Uh, happy anniversary. A lot of that coming on. Yeah. Because it really is the 18th. The 18th is our, is today. our actual today. Today is actually is five the years. actual five years. Yeah. Yep. Wow. Kalila. 
Kalila review number one <laughs> came out five years yep. ago today. That's right. That's right. So we are at the five-year mark. So one thing that's always fun, and I think we need to do a recorded one maybe with some depth, like top five over the five years or something. But, um, do you have one highlight that jumps out? And I sprung this on you, so it's not like you had time to think about it. Uh, one one highlight of the five years that that you were like you're still surprised by. No, none. Okay, not off the top since you sprung it on me. No, right. nothing. Right. nothing. Nothing. Nothing's coming to mind. My highlight Ooh. is still, and you'll probably and I'm blanking on his name, and I should have brought it up. But uh, that first viewer from Texas, that's wife died from I can't remember. It was a form of cancer where she was gone within six months. And he'd watched our show. She would drink wine. He would drink whiskey. And he's retired. And he's in Texas. And they'd watch the sunset. Robert Black. Boom. Mr. Black. That yeah. is it. <laughs> and uh, and he said after she died, he was a little depressed. Uh, he actually thought maybe he, was, he wasn't watching us, but he was consuming a bit too much, he thought. And he wasn't watching us, oh. I think, for a while. Or maybe, maybe he enjoyed whiskey with her. And then was drinking a little much. And then he found our show. And one of the things he decided to do was only drink when we had our show out. And then he would try to get what we were sampling and like drink with us. Mm -hmm. And then he found it um, just kind of pleasant to have the sunset. And he contacted us. That was one of the best, uh, you know, I, yeah. I, would, I never expected that we would have that reach. Because we're silly, we're goofy. But he found he got a little joy from it. It was, it was like a... Like he was hanging out with a couple of buddies and then he controlled kind of his drinking and picked up his mood a little bit. To me, that was, I would have, I mean, if you would have told me that could even happen, I would have been like, hell no. I mean, I might make somebody have a spit take with a weird hat or something, <laughs> but, but nothing that, that one was really surprised me. Cause I was like, wow. So that was nice. So that's uh, probably my highlight. I would Mark say. and Drew from the Scotch Four Dummies are on their way down here. Looks like they just went live a little bit ago. Hmm. Um, they're in the car. They uh, yeah, and they just texted. They probably don't know we went live. Sure. So, um, I was gonna pull up though the chat on here just so I could watch it. So because I'm leaning back away, the chat's over there. Bart's got oh, an great. eye on it. That's right. Uh, I've seen a lot. All right. Well, what do you think, sir? <laughs> What do you think is our weirdest video? What would you say? I got one off the top of my head. Weirdest. Oddest, like you're like, I was weird. I mean, I'm not saying bad. It could be weird good. whiskey or weird feel or Just weird, weird vibe. Weird show. We've done how many weird shows have we show. done? Have 530 we done? some. 530 shows. Weird show. Can I, I'll, I'll throw out mine, but I don't want to. The yoga. It was a little okay. weird to film. <laughs> Okay, because he was, I, I hadn't done any yoga at all. He'd done some, and I was coming into it like a total lark, but he was showing me some poses, and I was not taking it serious at all, right? No. But it's hard to take it serious when I'm wearing an Under Armour shirt that's a little small for my belly, <laughs> and I had short, like 1970s shorts on. But yeah, we were uh, we were out of sync on that one, and I've watched it recently. When I come around the corner in the gear I'm wearing, it's still a little shocking to me. And I was there when we filmed it. And uh, I'm, we were out of sync on that. And one. I'm like, and I can't believe I wore that. Hold on. Where, that. I don't know what you're doing. I was like, I'm a little surprised I wore that. I had no shame. Well, we had different things in mind. I actually thought we would try to do some yoga, and you were like, nope, nope, I'm doing two poses. That's it. Just two. I kind of wanted to get several in and kind of take choose the best ones. First of all, just two poses was wearing my wide body out. And you're like, no, this next one, you're going to stand on your head. And I'm like, that's not even possible. You're like, no, this one, you're going to bend your leg back behind your ear. I'm like, huh? That sounds sexual. Yeah, and he was like, "You're being, you're, you're not being serious." I'm like, "I know." <laughs> that one, that's not the weird part, though. The weird part is even when I look at it now, it's funny. Although I've had a lot of people comment, and I had even one gal that was a yoga gal that said she loved that when we were done, we just literally sat down on that wood floor where we'd been doing the yoga stuff, and we sat like cross-legged on the wood floor, and we did our little tasting right there. You remember what it was? The whiskey. I want to say it was a Balbany. Yeah, 14. Caribbean Boom. Cast. There you go. 
But uh, yeah, she's like, that was neat. And I was like, that's pretty cool. She actually enjoyed the fact that that we were so relaxed and just went right into the, the show. So I thought that was cool. See what anybody's saying here. Before the show, I'd never heard the term throat punch. <laughs> that's good. Oh, that was a lot of picked yeah, up throat that, punch. That's an odd one. Uh, yeah, that was where I got super excited with the, with the Freud shootout. family shootout. Yeah. Yeah, it was a little over the top. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I got over the top, and uh, that one still gets good views, but we'll still get people come in and go, that guy has kind of got on my nerves, and I'm like, sorry. I, I haven't seen that one in a while. Uh, I think many people have blocked out the yoga show for good reason, says Mike. <laughs> sure, now they'll go hit it again. Duncan, who was awesome. How about the Knob Creek Maple Whiskey episode? That was true. Here's what I think, and he pours it down the sink. That's true. You dump the whiskey right down the drain. Yeah. I was like, what are you doing? Yeah. You're and like, you were supposed to film me, but you were like, I got to hear well, film me. And the, you're like, what? What I didn't oh know my was God. you handed me your phone already recording, and then I thought I had to hit the button to record, and I actually stopped the recording. And then I was stunned. That was a good one. Toon Van Rouge says Knob Creek Maple as well. Yep. Uh, is what is what he thinks. Uh, Waits watching while working. Happy five years, says uh, Toft. Thank you. Uh, Chun says love the episode with the with the uh, with the half suits. That was a great one. That's where we were doing the whole um, um, uh, the president. What was that? Oh. The president one? No, that was the one. No, where, it was a uh, Campus Box uh, Delilah's blend. Damn, yeah, it was the the heavy the metal band. We did a beer with it. Yeah, yeah, that was Guinness. cool. And then we stand up at the end. Yeah. My wife still doesn't like that I did that see one. somebody earlier said the white um, undershirt one with the, they called it Italian suit jackets. Oh, so we need uh, uh, Elmer T. Model, right? Matter of fact. Wow, that was a good one. <laughs> My wife still does not like the one with the suit jackets. I wore a double set what? of underwear. Yeah, I wore a double set she of underwear. Like well, she believes she can see something. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's in the Christmas picture you sent out. That your too. Twins. That too. But on that one, she's like, I don't like it. I, she she's like a pants tent. There's just a, pant a reference. Tent. Just yeah. a reference. Uh, pant tent. Curb your enthusiasm. But yeah, I said no, baby. And she goes, What if something would have come out the barn door? And I said, I had a double set of underwear on. It was all safe. And by the way, it wasn't live. It was recorded. So uh, when cousin Shane first sang, that was pretty cool. I agree. Glenn live at 12. Yep. That was a good one. That was a good one. Um, someone really said good. who's Ebhead is saying whose mom was on. Well, we, we both. both had both of our moms on. In fact is I might see if my mom can make it to Saturday night down Ooh, to the barbecue show. Just cool. to come in and maybe even uh, taste mm -hmm. a peated whiskey. She'll come in and be like, you talking to your little friends? <laughs> <laughs> You're all our little friends. Like it's, I felt whenever she's over here, I feel like you and I are buds that are like 10 and we're just hanging out. Are you talking to your little friends? Mm -hmm. Well, I see Eric Wade is in here commenting. He's on his, or tomorrow he'll be on his way here. Ah, uh, his, uh, favorite, his favorite ep episode is the Aqua V K like recycling bottle episode that you did with all the burping. Every, and the yeah. And the people camp. think I was acting. In yeah. That. Yeah. I mean, he can lay down an entire court in a, in a <laughs> chug a lot and it affects him in no way. I'm pretty impressed with the Spaniard so far. This the is Glenn Levin 18. Good. Yeah, you, you know didn't what? say 18. You said 12. It was the 18. Oh, no, my, oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Preble. Preble yeah, I, almost, I thought you Glenn were setting Levitt me up. 18. I was like, why are you setting me up? My mom, my mom was on, on the Glenn Levitt 12. Gotcha. And the one where uh, they got to meet the puppies. That was true. The little chupacabras. They were little tiny puppies and they were all over. Claire remembers the sweatpants Christmas. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> oh man, that's just funny. I remember my wife said, You got to wear pants. What do you think of the Spaniards so far? I, I love it. it. Actually, oh, it's, it's good. Really it's got good that nice little sherry. I don't even have any water down here to add to it. <laughs> sherry there they are. Whoa. Whoa. Mark and Drew. <laughs> What's going Mark on, boys? What's it's happening? Your good. connection is good, man. Huh? Your connection's good on that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you were in a we car. Where you guys at? Oh, uh, maybe about 30 minutes down the road, down I-70. We got a ways to go. Because uh, you're going to St. Louis tonight, right? Yep. Going to make a pit stop in St. Louis. Got somewhere to crash and 
probably join a couple live shows. I think Aquavite is going live here in a little while too. So we're watching live shows and, and uh, kind of trying to document this journey. We're super excited. Congrats, by the way. Today's the day, guys. Yeah, yeah thank cool. you. Thank you. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks to the handiwork of this guy and all the, the tubers that got involved for that. Um, so we've, been, cool. we've been working on that one for a little while. We're kind of excited to put it out there. Yeah, you guys put a little bit of effort went into that one. So Bart hasn't had a chance to watch it yet. I, I, was, I did. I was it's at school great. conferences, and he said, watch it. I said, as soon as I get done, and then I came right over here. I haven't seen it yet. Yep. Oh, man, I can't wait. I actually we were going to do the whole thing for you at the, the whole thing at the uh, the dinner, and I was like, you know what? And I was talking to the tubers, and we talked this time, posted at the same time. It just didn't work out, so we posted today because today is the official right. day. So yeah, good. No, a lot of work went into that. We appreciate it. But uh, plays really good. If you haven't had a chance to watch on the Scotch Four Dummies channel, a uh, kind of a tribute video for our five year celebration this weekend. Yeah, so go check shoot. that out. We're in the middle of nowhere. Um, yeah. By the way, so we, we are bringing the file to you guys. You guys are going to have a copy of that. So once you guys have it, if you want to put it on your channel, we can take it off of ours or whatever. I mean, it belongs to you guys. Yeah, it's your stuff. So, I mean, we. I wanted to kind of surprise you with it, but at the end of the day, it, it's yours. So if you want to post it, put it out there, you know, it's really about you guys. Yep. Cool. Well, thank you. But you can it up on your side, too. Oh, absolutely. I mean, it's getting a lot of traction. A lot of people are leaving good comments for you guys out yeah, there. Yeah, but we so, want them to leave on your side. Yeah, too. I mean, that's your, <laughs> exactly. I just want to post it. I mean, so, you know, all the comments are for you guys. Anywho, Scott, we will be in touch and let you know what time to expect us on an ETA tomorrow because we're definitely going to try and come in early yeah. enough to make that happen. Yeah, we'll, okay, we'll do it. good. Good. Well, hey, guys, it's a bad connection. We're not going to take much of the, the, the show. Hey, to everybody out there, um, looking forward to seeing you guys tomorrow, man. Hey, All thanks, right, guys. We'll see you. See you guys later. See Got you, it, boys. Slancha. Slancha. <laughs> there we go. We're oh, sweet. All right. Yeah, I am actually jealous of your connection here. Well, that's not. I mean, you're just seeing. That's just the video that you're seeing. But It's looking clean. If you go there. Yeah. Look at that. Almost as I'm good. I'm not even hardwired in, so Kill that's what I tell you. You got to get yours looked at. Dude. So yep. what's up? Killing me. <laughs> hmm. well hey uh thanks to everybody that's tuned in we're gonna uh, i think probably wrap this one up uh looking forward to the weekend i seen hoyt hempel was in here uh comment we've had a few people uh lana lose on her way tomorrow um what is the one where scott in the let's just say bathroom was the weirdest that was the very first quick hitter i did in because you did yours and uh you talked board games and you Pull something oh, down, so I went in the bathroom, and I yeah, you I did mine me. from the bathroom. A lot of and mocking. Had some board games in there with me. That's right. That was weird. <laughs> that was weird. That was wrong too, on many levels. That was wrong. Oh yeah, the habanero episode. That was. That was we a need good to re one. Actually, I want to redo that one. Well, and we were talking about we need to create a new bet because I got the idea that that one of us, whoever loses said bet, has to get their chest waxed. Ooh. Ouch. I want to win it. That's better than other parts. Ooh. Well, it'll be my stepdaughter. You know, hey, you, doing, my wife showed who me. Who has an actual license. My wife showed me there's these clinics now, and they yeah. do this. Um, men can go there and find out what given childbirth or childbirth feels like. Why? Why would you want to do that? And they're filming these guys <laughs> as they literally, they strap these things on their abs that make them contract and stuff. For It takes like an hour, hour and a half, and it slowly builds up the... Was it shock pain and level? Stuff? Well, no, yeah. it's just well, it's probably shock that makes the abs contract. What if you have a? But they're pretty funny. Really, and you want to well, do that? I don't want to do it. I'm just saying they're pretty <laughs> funny to watch. <laughs> all right, I don't know about all that. I'm pretty hairy though. <laughs> all right, uh, let's wrap this one up. If you're in, like I say, tonight, uh, maybe around six ish, we'll uh, try to keep everybody updated on social media. We'll head to the Monarch. Now, Christine, uh, down on Douglas. Christ down, it's not on Douglas. Christine said uh, she'll yeah, be with Douglas. us in spirit. It Sorry. is, yeah. 
I did have a Christine yeah. call wanting to know about tickets. Caroline, you said earlier. Was it Caroline? That's what you said earlier. I have to look. Sorry. There's a C letter and I get confused. <laughs> <laughs> All righty. Um, Compass Box of Spaniard, thanks to uh, the person responsible for us getting a bottle. And um, we'll see a lot of you this weekend. Wow. Uh, good thoughts to everybody going on our fifth anniversary. And You're going to see manga. I'm going to be bringing manga to the show. A lot of manga. A lot of manga. All right. Scotch it. You scotch gods. Salonja. Dummies. <laughs>